Before our life on Earth started, before the moon traced its orbit around the Earth, before our solar system was born, before time and space were created, before life had given birth to a form, an awe-inspiring silence reigned, and complete darkness. A power, an energy, lives in this darkness, a source from which all life stemmed. We can also call this all source God, or life, or weighty. When the all source sends its energy into space, in order to give itself a form, it produces vibrations. Those vibrations make the space move. And after millions of years, these vibrations can condense to rarefied hazes. The first hazes spread themselves into space, but they also become rarefied again quite quickly. However, at this beginning stage, they do not have enough energy to maintain an independent form. Yet, they fill the space with condensed energy, so that the second series of hazes can receive more form and more growth. In this way, a third series of hazes can originate because the all source continues to drive, continues to create. This process of creation has seven periods, seven grades. And at the end of the third period, we see that the hazes momentarily light up. Light in space didn't just happen at once. There is as yet no sun to emanate light. We can see light as an expression, an illumination of energy, of condensing and consciousness. These hazes radiate more light as they become stronger and achieve more condensing. Compared to our present solar system, the light from our sun is billions of times stronger, more materialized. Later, the spiritual being will also radiate light as there is more strength, more consciousness, and love in his inner self. First, the hazes are a deep blue color. At the end of the fifth period, the hazes achieve such a strong energy that they radiate a golden glow. When the golden light becomes rarefied, the transitions from blue to gold get the chance to condense as independent colors, such as light blue and pale green. However, the colors are not there all at once. They have been formed in a cosmic process of creation. We can compare the seven grades of this process with the seven colors of the rainbow. When the hazes start to connect, start to mix with each other, more color tints, more nuances, more character traits, more consciousness originate. Later, the human being will also radiate his character and his grade of evolution as the color of his aura. And then, the seventh and last period of this cosmic process of evolution begins. Up until now, all the life in the universe has been a unity, but that is starting to change. In this seventh grade of condensing, the hazes achieve their utmost strength and density. The all source will now start to unload the built-up pressure and tension into this space by splitting and dividing itself. Just as the discharge of earthly storm clouds are accompanied by thunder and lightning, and the clouds diverge and divide into millions of raindrops, the all source divides itself into billions of particles. With these separate particles, something new can now be built up. By means of absorbing the surrounding energy to a central point, comparable to the present-day tornado on Earth, the first separate heavenly bodies are formed in this space, a sun and a planet. 
Thanks to the warmth of the sun, the first planet can condense its energy further into hazes. <laughs>